Welcome back to the next part in my firmware 3.5 dialing in series. And today we're taking a look at one of the new moon models that the fine folks at line six have recently given us in the firmware 3.5 update. What an update it is. What an amp model this is. This is an amp model based on the sun model T. And again, I was extremely blown away with this amp. Really loved working with it through the whole beta time I had with it and creating some cool tones with it. So as of the time you're watching this video, I will have my Moon Ultimate preset bundle available from the Line 6 marketplace and it's going to have both Helix versions and HX Stomp versions. Obviously going to be stripped back versions for the Stomp versions but the Helix versions are going to have a full array of effects and you're going to get to hear how this chord tone we developed in today's video along with the presets from the Ultimate bundle are going to sound in a full production I did with my good friends Marco Miniman and Jason Henry so that'll be coming up a little later in the video but first let's create this tone that I'm going to have up on custom tone for free. So here we are over at the JS Moon Bright preset and I'm using just that the new moon bright model uh, let's start at the end of the chain here we have the LA studio comp just doing a little tiny bit of compression as I like to do at the end peak reduction at 6.5 gain at 5 mix is actually just at 60 we'll turn that off for now because we want to hear just this core amp tone before we add all of those little features in uh, the EQ block uh, 400 hertz mid Q of 1.4 I'm pulling those frequencies out by minus 3 dB clean up a little bit of mud make them a little more mix ready Low cut at 100 hertz, high cut at 11 kilohertz. We'll turn that off. I have a little bit of dynamic room reverb with these settings, 0.8 seconds, very, very subtle mix of 25%. You can obviously add more in if you so desire. We'll turn that off. I have a transistor tape delay if you want to click that in just to have a little bit of echo on your sound. These are the typical settings I use. Low and high shelf, uh, both set at 650 hertz on the low and high frequencies, minus 3 dB on the low gain and plus 3 dB on the high gain to give it a little more polish and a little bit more of a mix ready sound. Now, coming up to the amp, I am using the bright model, so I'm using the bright drive. The norm drive does not have any effect on the sound. So just on the bright drive setting here of five, bass is also at five, mid is at 6.7, Treble is at 4.5, channel volume at 6.7, presence at 5, master at 7.5, and all the deeper functions are exactly the same. Now, going on to our new cab block. I am using the brand new 412 Moon T75 cab, and using the 121 ribbon on the center of the speaker, one inch back, zero degrees instead of the 45 degree settings, and the low and high cut turned off since I'm going to have those baked into the old parametric EQ at the end. So without any of this other fancy stuff going on, here's what this preset sounds like, just with the raw amp and cabinet with those settings I showed you. All right, so let's start bringing in the other processing. I'll bring that compressor at the end. Just barely kissing the sound. We'll clean up a little bit of that mud. Bring that reverb in. Very subtle. If we do want that delay, it's gonna sound like this. Now, bringing in the high and low shelf EQ to give it a little more polished, mix ready sound. that out again. So 
I was really happy with the way that that turned out. So that preset's available on Custom Note, the link below. There is a Stomp version and a Helix version. And this is basically a little piece of one of the core tones from my Moon Ultimate preset package, which is available on the Line 6 Marketplace right now. Again, both Stomp and Helix versions are included in it. But how do the presets from that ultimate package sound in a full production? Well, here's the song that I had mentioned before. This is a song I recently re-recorded with my good friends Marco Miniman on drums and Jason Henry on bass using nothing but the presets from the Moon Ultimate preset pack with no post-processing in the mix. So you can give that a listen.
All right, what did you guys think? I was extremely happy with the way that all turned out. The tones worked really well in the mix. Didn't really have to do anything to them. So if you guys do want those presets, this one that we created today, the stripped down version is available, as I mentioned, on Custom Tone at the link below. And if you're so inclined to grab the full Ultimate Package, it's also available today at the Line 6 Marketplace at the link below. And you can grab that and you kind of help to support my channel and help me to keep doing these videos that hopefully will help a few folks. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed that. Please like the video and please share it with anybody who you think would get some use or enjoyment out of watching it. Also, please subscribe to the channel. Hit the little bell notification. Get notified when I put new content out. I'll be back really soon with some more, especially some more firmware 3.5 content. Thank you guys again so much for sharing your time with me. Ciao for now.